What's up, everybody? This is Jesus Esparza. You know, I just want to do this kind of review for, you know, for quite a quite a while that I wanted to do. But now, now it is time. And um, those are all my Monster Jam World Finals DVDs I, that I have. And, you know, yeah, it's been a historic Monster Jam World Finals. with been hosted in Las Vegas for many years. And now, now this year they went to Orlando, Florida. And, and they were coming back to Orlando in 2020, but they're now doing Monster Gene World Finals anywhere else. But, you know, I'd like to review all these Monster Gene World Finals DVDs that I have. And, you know, I would like to review it right now. This is Monster Gene World Finals 8 from 2007. I was not on that World Finals because um that's from 2007. But I just received that um, Monster Gene World Finals 8 DVD when you purchased a Double Down package. That's where I received that DVD. So, yeah. Monster Jam World Finals 8 from 2007. I was not on that World Finals on that time. Yeah. this You can see the trucks here. We got Avenger, Captain's, Captain's Curse, Maximal Destruction, Grieve Digger, Batman, Bounty Hunter, Superman, Blue Thunder, Pastrana, Y99, Moximut, and Escalade, El Toro Loco, Safe Auto Minimizer, Taz, Hot Wheels, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Suzuki, Brutus, Moxabot Dalmatian, Destroyer, Scarlet Bandit, US Air Force Afterburner, Iron Outlaw, King Crunch. Yeah, these are the trucks lined up from 2007. Monster Jam World Finals in Las Vegas at that time, and it's pretty cool. Well, and again, I was not on that World Finals at that time, but I received that DVD when I purchased that Double Down package. So, yeah, that's Monster Jam World Finals 8. And and this is Monster Gene World Finals 9 from 2008. The, this, is, this is where my very first Monster Gene World Finals at back in 2008. This is where I first started. And when I went there, and man, I never get to experience, I never seen this kind of, you know, the stadium floor and and what is kind of world Monster Gene World Finals looks like. And I met so many drivers and all that. And and see the racing and freestyle and and there is an encore where backwards bob debuts and um and spitfire which is now renamed to dragon's breath yeah which is spitfire when they debuts here and yeah it is really a fun time there my very first monster Gene world finals nine in 2008 in las vegas and yeah it really it really is great and yeah the trucks line up from 2008 Monster Jam World Finals 9 in Las Vegas. Monster Mutt, Captain's Curse, Grave Digger, Maximal Destruction, El Toro Loco, Monster Mutt, Dalmatian, Safe Auto Minimizer, Taz, Avenger, Superman, Bounty Hunter, Suzuki, King Crunch, Destroyer, US Air Force Afterburner, Batman, Scarlet Bandit, Star, Stone Crusher, An, An Escalade, Pastrana, Winding Night, Blue Thunder, one of my favorites, Donkey Kong, Iron Outlaw, and Black Stallion. Yeah. It really is. Um, I had a fun time. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. That's how the Monster Jam World Finals uh, 9 2008 DVD look, looks like. And they're John C. Sock, Adam Anderson. John C. Sock was a racing champion. And Adam Anderson in freestyle when he was in Taz at that time. These are the trucks here from that time. And there's Destroyer, Scarlet Bandit, Maximum Destruction, Blue Thunder, Grave Digger. My most favorite Donkey Kong, <laughs> yeah, and it and right behind the background, and it was like Sandboy Stadium. Since Sandboy Stadium will come into a close when, when the, the new um the new Las Vegas Stadium, which is now called Al, Allegiant Stadium. I don't know what it's called, but that's a new name of the Las Vegas Stadium. Once it's, once it opens in twenty twenty. So yeah. Hopefully, a Monster Jam World Finals should be held in um, Al and Allegiant Stadium. I know it should come, but well, we'll see. Yeah. Mhm. Mm and let's let's see them. Monster Jam World Finals ten from two thousand nine, and that's where Tom Mintz was racing, and Damon Brashaw in um U.S. Air Force Afterburner. Yeah. They say 2009 Monster Gene World Finals 10. 
yeah. As you can see, Nitro Circus was Dave used in freestyle. And yeah, and there's Medusa. Yeah, that's where the time when I first met Medusa for the first time. That's pretty great. And these are the trucks. It's Grave Digger, Maximum Destruction, Medusa, El Toro Loco, Monster Mutt Dalmatian, Avenger, War Wizard, Safe Auto Minimizer, Donkey Kong, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Bounty Hunter, US Air Force Afterburner, Batman, Blue Thunder, Captain's Curse, Monster Mutt, and Escalade, King Crunch, Nitro Circus, and Freestyle, Pastrana 189, and Racing, Destroyer, Brutus, Stone Crusher, Superman, Taz, and yeah, a lot of great lineups at that time, you know. And, and oh yeah, and this is where we're Maximal Destruction, Captain, Cur Captain's Curse are in, in the final round. And then suddenly, Ale Alex Blackwell, Captain's Curse, he has a huge crash here during racing in the final in the finals and then he just crashed right into the stance but no one got hurt that time and I I was saw that and man I have never seen this kind of crash like that in my life. Yeah. That was shocking and man I was um I had never seen this coming at that time. Yeah. And that's from Monster Jam World Finals two thousand nine, World Finals ten and yeah. Pretty pretty good. And that's one 2010 Monster Jam World Finals. Monster Jam World Finals 11. Yeah, this is from 2010. Dennis Anderson, Grave Digger, Charlie Pawkins, Moximut. Yeah, Dennis Anderson, Grave Digger wins racing. And then Charlie Pawkins, Moximut wins freestyle. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, that's from 2010. And it was pretty good. And yeah, the trucks are. U.S. Air Force Afterburner, Avenger, Batman, Blue Thunder, Bounty Hunter, Captain's Curse, El Toro Loco, and Escalade, Grave Digger, Advanced Auto Parts, Grinder, Gunslinger, Iron Man, King Crunch, Medusa, Maximum Destruction, Monster Mutt, Monster Mutt Dalmatian, Nitro Circus, Shock Therapy, Spider Man, Stone Crusher, Superman, Taz, Teenage, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah. There's Mohawk Warrior. This is Mohawk Warrior's debut there on the Encore. Yeah, that's pretty great. And then Monster Jam World Finals 12. Monster Jam World Finals 12. Yeah, from 2011. Avenger, Maximum Destruction. Tom Mintz, Maximum Destruction wins racing. And, and Jim Kohler, Avenger wins freestyle by a tiebreaker. But they were selected who, who should be champion. And then... And then the, and they uh, selected is Jim Kohler Avenger. Yeah. And these are our drivers in the trucks lineup. Yeah. Our Air Force after US Air Force Afterburner, Avenger, Backdraft, Batman, Bounty Hunter, Brutus, Captain's Curse, Lucas Oil Crusader, El Toro Loco, Grave Digger, Grave Digger the Legend, Advanced Auto Parts Grinder, Iron Man. Medusa, Maximum Destruction, Mohawk Warrior, Moximut, Moximut Dalmatian, uh, Nitro Circus, Shock Therapy, Spider Man, Stone Crusher, Superman, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah. This was a pretty good, um, good year on that time, so. Yeah. I need to speed this up a little bit, but, because there's a lot. And then Monster Jam World Finals 13. 13 from 2012 yeah Tom Mintz and Maximum Destruction and Racing, Kama Queen North or Nightmare Freestyle, yeah yeah I was there that time since um it was, since, if you might, if you might did not know this, this was my dad's last World Finals since once we got back home after after Moschian World Finals 13 2012 and and, and he passed away yeah, that's one of my saddest thing I never felt after Monster Jam World Finals 13 in 2012. Yeah, it was heartbroken for me, you know. But we still have a lot of fun time there before before he's gone, you know. Yeah, 2012 Monster Jam World Finals. It's a pretty great year. And they even they left the El Toro Loco truck um, on this um, container 
I don't know what to call it, but it was stands right there, and I have never, I I have never seen, I have never seen anything like this in my life, and it was great. It was they leave it there, and you know, yeah, yeah, they just leave it there whenever um, other trucks trying to go over or something. Yeah, the trucks are not that light. That light, the trucks line up on that 2012 Monster Chain World Final. This is. Avenger, Bounty Hunter, Brutus, Captain America, Captain's Curse, Lucas Oil Crusader, El Toro Loco, Grave Digger, Grave Digger Legend, Advanced Auto Parts Grinder, Team Hot Wheels, Firestorm, Iron Man, Medusa, Maximum Destruction, Metal Militia, Mohawk Warrior, Monster Energy, Monster Mutt, Monster Mutt Dalmatian, Northern Nightmare, Son of a Digger, Spider Man, Stone Crusher, Wolverine. Yeah. It sure is. Um, that 2012 Monster Jam World Final is a pretty good year. Yeah, and then 2013 Monster Gene World Finals from Monster Gene World Finals 14. Yeah, it was a. Uh, I couldn't who were the champions, but you know, wait, I think I almost forgot something. Yeah, Grave Digger's 30th anniversary, and yeah, Medusa. I think I almost forgot about this. Um, yeah, because um, oh yeah. It is an encore from Grave Digger and from 2010, and well, Lindsay Wink Blue Thunder almost trying to do a backflip, but no one missed this. But you know, yeah, let's see him. Monster Gene World Finals 10, and there's Travis Pastrana, and you know, Medusa, and let me see him. There should be more. Yeah, that was that. Uh, I almost forgot about this, but, you know. Okay. 2013 Monster Chain World Finals. Um, 14. Um, yeah, another pretty great year. Including Maximal Destruction's 10th anniversary, I think. Yeah. Let me see. Uh, the cover says Monster Mutt, Grave Digger, Team Hot Wheels Firestorm, and, and the debut truck of Zombie, what the fans picked, you know. I sure wish Monster Jam and Felder Entertainment should, should start doing more fan votes about if they want what kind of brand new Monster Jam truck do they want to see next. They should do that. They should do that more, more often. Yeah, let me see. There's Son of a Digger and Maximal Destruction and or Max D. Yeah, those are the trucks lined up from you know from 2013 Monster Jam World Finals. And yeah, to see Max D's um 10th anniversary encore and it was a pretty great encore. Yeah. The, the trucks are on that Monster Jam World Finals 14 in 2013. It was Advanced Auto Parts Grinder, Avenger, Bad Habit, Batman, Blue Thunder, Bounty Hunter, Captain Captain America, Captain's Curse, El Toro Loco, Grave Digger, The Legend, Grave Digger Grave Digger. Man, sorry, I've just um, uh, Iron Man, Lucas Oil Crusader, Medusa, uh, Max D, Metal Militia, Mohawk Warrior, Monster Energy, Monster Mutt, Monster Mutt Dalmatian, Northern Nightmare, Scooby Doo, Son of a Digger, Spider Man, Stone Crusher, Superman, Team Hot Wheels, Firestorm, Zombie. Yeah, and um, and 2014 Monster Gene World Finals 15. Yeah, sure is. Um, it's pretty good when they were featured 32 trucks competing. Yeah, 32. <laughs> it was featured 32 trucks, and yeah, on that time, and you know, oh yeah, most of the lights 24, but in 2013 one was featuring 28. It featured 28 and. And then 2014 Monster Jam World Finals and 15, they put on 32 trucks. Yeah. Sure is. Um. And then 2015 Monster Jam World Finals for Monster Jam World Finals 16. Yeah, Overkill Evolution and Metal Militia and yeah, for 32 trucks and you know. Yeah, there's N New Earth Authority. Blue Dragon El Toro Loco, yeah, on the encore, and, and then 
the 2016 Monster Gene World Finals. Monster Gene World Finals 17. Yeah. Sure is. Um, it's, it's pretty a good year. But, um, you know. Looks pretty good. You know. Yeah. This is all my review of, of all of my Monster Gene World Finals. Some um, DVDs I collected. Since been in Las Vegas for many years. They're now doing Monster Gene World Finals anywhere else. Now, Orlando, Florida is one of them. And they're doing it in Orlando in 2020. I wonder what's next for the future. But, you know. Well, if you like all my Monster Gene World Finals DVDs that I review with you. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share. And 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 comment below what do you think about them. What do you think you might? What's your favorite um, Monster Jam World Finals DVD, or or your favorite Monster Jam DVD, or if Monster Jam Field Entertainment should start making more of those kind of Monster Jam World Finals DVDs like that, you know? We want it more, but yeah, okay. I'll see you guys soon. Now, it was um, I'd like to review all this um Monster Jam World Finals DVD, but yeah. Just don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you guys soon.